Alright, welcome back <coughs> to part two of J Ting. I don't think we need to see that. We're actually doing pretty well. We've had a couple we've had a close call just before I made the save, but we all all that's left now is Zuge Leong. To a glorious victory. It's been a relatively easy mission actually. Because we have quite a bit of attack power now, we're able to do a lot of damage to the officers. Which is a good thing, really. That's one of the main things that kind of was annoying about the last mission. We didn't have enough attack power. Or oh, defense, for that matter. Now we've got a little bit more. We're doing alright. Obviously, could be a stand to be a lot more powerful, but this is more than satisfactory to requirements. So all that's left now is. I believe. Yep. Just the big guy himself and his three gates. It's not three, is it? Of course, I mean, I can follow. Nay! Okay, leave the archers just for a minute. Just for a minute, of course, not too long. We will come back and quabble them. As you can see, our morale's pretty good now, so victory is imminent. And. We're just going to deal with his gate captains. We've got another bomb rush scenario where it's just us against Zuge Leon. Oh wow, we gave more reinforcements. <laughs> yeah, I'm awesome. Off we go. <laughs> What's that? That major gets his. <laughs> that major gets his. Time in the sun. I killed that one guy. That's it. I'm done. <laughs> Mission over. <laughs> I will get all the credit in the way reports for that. Quiet B-Box down. All that remains is his gate captains. Hmm. Full scale attack. Ah, Weyon has been defeated. That means it's just, really is just us and Zuge Weyong now. Uh, we have to be careful because Zuge Weyong is quite close. Fire started. Come on, fire! No, you gate captain. Not to touch the cape. I much prefer the four combo. It's hard. It's kind of hard to hit my fifth combo because it's sort of a narrow focus. So much preferring the fourth combo, really, just to do the extra damage. There we go. Secure the gate. Just gonna. Get the defense, get the attack, find the gate captain who appears to be camping near the boss. Here he is. Yes, you are going to lose. Oh, he's pretty that is pretty powerful in the game we own. Fighting fighting wise. So we need to be sorta of careful. We're gonna be pushed around that easily. I really want to get to that gate captain, actually, if I can, but he's standing around so close to Zuge Leong, we may not have the luxury of uh, doing that right now. There we go. There we go. Oh, no, you don't. I just want your gate captain. You can live for a few more seconds. Let me eliminate this guy. There we go. Ah. See, it's kind of hard to hit it because if you slightly miss Q it, you're screwed. No, Zuge Leong taking another name. If I'm gonna die, I'm gonna take many of your men with me. Look at this guy is strafing like a kind of strike player or something. Strafe and shoot, strafe and shoot, man. I'm sorry, Zuge Leong, you're Ow! Damn it, dude. Oh, no. want your archer. There we go. Right. That's just systematically. Wow, he's gonna have a lot of defense. If his guards have a lot of defense, Zuge Leung himself will have a lot of defense. So let's just eliminate his guards. Trip him slowly but surely. No need to rush. We have this under control. Ow. They're heading straight for me. You are the man with the cape. I must defeat you. I don't think it's possible to predict your own death. Would you be like, I know when I'm no, no, all oh, good, he was stunned. That could have been that could have been a game over there. It's it's very hard. He's not the strongest we've ever fought, but at this stage in the game, since we're so late in, he will hit for quite a bit. 
Bam! No rash moves. No stupid moves at this point. Actually, we're hitting him at... Nah, we're hitting him slightly less... Slightly more damage than his guards, I think. Good. Down he goes. So yeah, while we're sort of kicking Zuge Weong's ass here, just to let you know, Iwin was actually pretty nice. My holiday I took, uh, it was pretty okay. I thought Dubwin was a bit too sort of touristy for the most part. You know, it wasn't really that great. I mean, I've been there before and seen its sights, so I kind of knew what to expect, but went to a horrible place called Temple Bar, which was had this really shitty music guy trying to play Irish music. You know, it wasn't like proper Irish music, it was shit. You can see the best strategy, Frankie. And then we went to a, a place called Galway, which I believe is famous for its races, and the races were on, and that was actually a bit more impressive. Kind of like a coastal town sort of thing. So we stayed there, got stuck in the traffic, and then went to uh, Adair, which is my grandfather's hometown. Then we went to Wimwick to watch the Man City game. Wimwick was kind of meh. Suge Young's kind of meh. To win without finding is the ultimate plan, eh? Then why didn't you run away when I was coming at you? Oh well, strike a pose. There we go. And that was my Iowan trip. It was okay. Iowan wasn't that impressive. So, now that I've told you about my holiday, let's check out how the battle was won. Marsu was defeated first. I figured we should have taken him out early because usually if it's saying like Suspicious NG was unfortunately wiped out in battle, Poor girl. Usually if they're saying like they're doing something suspicious, you should probably check it out and quab them. So then we took out Ma Shao, took out Wee Yan. Things were still going bad for a bit. But we gained the upper hand. And Shao Yun met his maker, although we didn't actually kill any of them, we just injured them. I mean this maybe this won't be the last mission. And after <laughs> a bit of time. Coming at 18 minutes, Suge Weon finally fell. And the mission was a glorious success. Hmm. Oh wow. HP max plus 33. Whoa! Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll take that. Not too bold. The other one didn't have much of a great attack bonus anyway. Having a lot of HP will be very useful. Ah, good. Bow defense upgrade. That's a very good item to get upgraded, that bow defense. Uh, this one is discarded because it's not as useful. We have a plus 10 one. Oh, minus 200. Not, I, don't really, I still don't know how the bonuses are calculated, but I can assume it might be if you lose officers or if you just take too long. But we took out 8 guys, so as a result, we get a bit of bonus. Just me under 2k. See if that gives us anything. Nope, nothing acquired. Oh well, you do. Yeah, I think we'll save. Okay. I'm gonna save in a different swap this time for just a feel like it. Oh, okay. This wasn't the final mission. There's one left. I will skip that for now. Alright, so, we're not done with Shu yet. Oh, this mission. This is quite an epic final mission, actually. <laughs> I didn't think we'd get this, to be honest, but we did. So, alright, so, I will catch you all. Thank you for watching. This probably hasn't been one of my better episodes, because I'm kind of hung over, and <laughs> occasionally my commentary may run astray, but let me know what you think. Hopefully next time I do one of these, I'll be in a bit more, uh, less hungover. <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching. Please leave comments below. Please, please, please leave comments. And I will catch you all next time for what really is the final mission in the Sahundun campaign. No fooling. It really is the last one. Wuzhang Plains. Be there. Or, or don't. You know, you can just go away and do parties if you wish. Anyway, catch you later.